The Mizzou track and field team had the indoor SEC championship meet last weekend. While there, sprinters Markish Woodson and Kamari Montgomery had stellar performances and will carry the momentum of SECs into nationals this weekend in Birmingham, Alabama. I didn't really think that it was going to be that big of a meet as much as it was, but I'm glad that the outcome was how it was. SECs is a show, you know, the people that belong to be there with the competition of their team. I feel like when you, once you get to nationals, it becomes more of an individual um, achievement, you know? Saying that you are an NCAA athlete, that actually is an NCAA athlete, competitor in NCAA as well as in the classroom and those on the track. Montgomery, a freshman sprinter, broke his own school record in the 400 meter dash on Friday and followed that up with a 45.78 second 400 meter sprint on Saturday, a top 10 time in the world right now. Montgomery now sits at number five in the national rankings. Kind of, like I said, I'm, I'm a better performer when I'm under pressure, and I felt like coming into the meet with all those people around me and all the big you know, runners around me and stuff, I kind of used it to my motivation. I didn't freak, I didn't panic, I just went out and ran my race. Montgomery also broke Woodson's record in the 200-meter dash that same weekend, but neither seemed to mind. I told him the first day of the season started, I told him I was going to break his indoor record, and he laughed, and he's like, you're going you're gonna to take some speed to do that, and I told him I'll do it, and I went out and did it. So it's all fun and games. Yeah, and yeah. He's a, he's a good athlete. If it was by someone that's not good, then maybe I'd have been a little upset, but he's actually not even good. He's great. He's a great athlete. Woodson had an excellent weekend himself. For the third time in his career, he ended up on the 60-meter dash podium. Woodson is now ranked fifth in the nation for the 60-meter dash and will join Kamari Montgomery in Birmingham. This will be Woodson's last crack at NCAAs. I have no really bad emotions, you know. I'm just grateful that I made it here healthy enough to compete in another NCAA. Um, and also, they're still outdoors. Do you kind of view this as a passing of the torch moment, having a senior and a freshman go down there? When I first came to the University of Missouri, Kenneth Chambers was here, but he wasn't doing too well. He was doing well enough. And for me to come and then do the same thing that Kamari did and win SEC Freshman Championship, um, it made me feel that I opened up a gateway to Mizzou Sprints, you know, the program and everything like that, back again to show that we're not out for competition. And then with Coach Carter bringing in the more recruiting of everyone else, it just made it seem a lot better. He basically told me to treat it as a business trip. It's still a normal meet. It's still, it's just a normal meet with bigger people. As the focus now shifts towards nationals, a top eight finish in their events would earn the athletes a first team All-American honor. Actually just trying to get out here and do the best that I can to compete the best of my ability and I know that I can compete well. So I'm going for the highest placement that I can get. How are you going to be ready to perform well to finish top eight and be first team All-American? Um, keep my head on straight, basically like what Keish told me. Um, pray, keep God first, and just go out and do what I love to do. Events for the meet will begin on Friday, March 11th with semifinal rounds, followed by the finals on Saturday, March 12th.